Hi, Albert here with Mainland Cycle Center. Today I want to show you a 2017 Kawasaki Brute Force 750 and this is the EPS electronic power steering model in camo. Great looking machine, that camo finish, those black wheels uh, really looks good. Of course the Brute Force 750s, uh, this model, this current generation has been around since 2012 so about five years uh, running on this model. Uh, no real major changes in that time other than colors and things, but uh, still just a great four-wheeler 750cc parallel uh, V-twin, 750cc V-twin. These are fuel injected. Uh, we do offer models with or without power steering. The camo model is equipped with power steering. These are liquid cooled, uh, fuel injected, like I said, and uh, fully independent suspension. And these Brute Force 750s really, really run strong. Um, we sold lots and lots of these in the heyday of the ATVs before the side-by-sides really came on strong and the Brute Force 750 has always been a real popular model. It really, really runs strong. This is probably one of, I believe, one of the best as far as high-end four-wheelers you can buy for the money. We can catch these on sale, a little bit of rebate on them. Really a great value on these Brute Force 750s. And like I said, don't let that 750 fool you. This four-wheeler will run right along uh, pretty much every four-wheeler out there with a bigger motor. Uh, even up to some of the 1000s this thing will in a drag race. It'll be right there. These are really really strong running machines uh, full floorboards got uh, Two storage compartments. So you've got one here There and then you've got another one here on the front there and Then 12 volt power outlet these are selectable two-wheel drive and four-wheel drive and then these also have a locking front differential. So a little different on this bike, it's got a little yellow lever, you pull that lever, and it's a variable differential lock, so you can set the amount of lock you have. I Meaning you can increase the traction a little bit without fully locking that front differential. And part of the reason that's pretty important is uh, it helps save that front differential. Those front differentials, uh, when they're fully locked, you have to be a little easy on them or else you can break a front differential. And that's regardless of what brand full wheeler you're looking at. Uh, this has the alloy wheels. These are 12 inch wheels with 25 inch Duro tires. As we mentioned, it's fully independent suspension. Uh, one of the great things about the Brute Force is it has our Kawasaki's multi-disc wet rear brake. And so what do we mean by that? What we mean by that is there's no brake on inside either rear wheel. The brake is actually on the drive shaft coming back and it's built in to the front of this gear case and it actually rides in an oil bath. So it rides in the same oil that these gears ride in. And because of that, it stays really, really clean and you'll probably never replace the rear brakes. And so it's just really, really great feature. Not only does it work, but it works all the time. Uh, stainless steel muffler on these. Nice big rear rack. Your fuel tank is in the back. Uh, so your fuel fill is there. Uh, like I said, these are an automatic transmission, low, high, neutral, and reverse. There's your selectable two-wheel drive and four-wheel drive switch, front brake lever, your throttle, and then these have digital instrumentation. So it'll tell you uh, speedometer, clock, odometer, fuel gauge, uh, if you're in two-wheel drive or four-wheel drive, reverse light, all that good stuff. Uh, and then over here, you've got the green buttons, your start, red buttons, engine stop. And then the gray button there is uh, headlights off, low, and high beam. And then this reverse button here says override. That overrides the reverse limiter. So it has a reverse limiter that kicks in once you get up to a certain speed in reverse. And you push and hold that button, and it will override the reverse limiter. Uh, like we mentioned, these are liquid cooled. There's your coolant reservoir right there. Really easy to check. Um, Let's see, what else? Just really, really great four-wheelers. Like I said, don't underestimate these Brute Force 750s. Uh, they really, really do run strong. All right, well, that's a look at the 2017 Brute Force 750 EPS Camo. Uh, we are Mainland Cycle Center. We're located in Lamarck, Texas. We're about 30 minutes south of downtown Houston, just off of I-45. You can find us online at mainlandcyclecenter.com or by phone at 409-948-4969. And we would just love it if you give us a call, shoot us an email, or even better, come by and see us in person here at Mainland Cycle Center, where we'd love to help any way that we can. Hey, thanks for watching.